Hello, my name is Louisa and I'm a clinical technologist working in nuclear medicine. Hello, my name is Catherine and I'm a specialist clinical technologist in radiotherapy. A job in clinical technology is a job where science, technology and compassion come together to save lives. Every day I use cutting-edge tools and innovative treatments to care for patients. Technologists work in hospitals, industry and research. My job involves the service and repair of linear accelerators, CT scanners and other equipment used in delivering radiotherapy. I am also involved in the design, development and manufacture of medical devices. As a nuclear medicine clinical technologist, I am involved in the production of radioactive medicine, which I then give to patients. These allow us to see what is happening in real time inside their bodies. I prepare patients for each procedure and I explain to them how the injection, capsule or gas will show their organs shining in our scans. I help each person by carefully explaining the effects of the radiation and how to be safe during and after their visit. The best thing about my job is the challenge and satisfaction of repairing complex equipment and knowing it will then be used to treat patients as accurately and effectively as possible. I work in a diverse team, along with doctors, radiographers, physicists, nurses and healthcare assistants. Day to day, I work with a range of people who rely on me to service and repair radiotherapy equipment. This includes radiographers who use the equipment, radiotherapy physicists who also test the equipment, and equipment manufacturers. Sometimes I'm involved with projects that directly work with patients, carers and the public to get their input. The impact my job has on patients is that our scans help to detect diseases earlier and even when the disease is still very small, which makes a huge difference in beating and recovering from it. They also help the clinical teams to check if the disease is progressing or if the treatments are working. Patients visit our department several times and the information we give about their health status really matters to what happens next in their lives. My job has such a huge impact on patients. If the machines aren't working properly, I'm the person responsible for getting them back up and running. This sometimes means that patients are literally waiting outside for their cancer treatment while I'm repairing the machine that will be delivering their treatment. People are usually surprised to find out that our job is not just about cancer. We see many patients diagnosed with cancer, but we actually see different groups of the population, from little babies and pregnant people to high-performance athletes. We diagnose people with cardiac disease and dementia, and we are also particularly good at investigating mysterious diseases. Something about my job that surprises people how much it really takes to keep hospital equipment running. We're all always working behind the scenes to make sure that everything is working safely. You can be an active researcher, create new software, apply AI programs, become a specialist in radiation protection or an expert in leading complex procedures. There has been so much scientific innovation in recent years. It is a very exciting area to be part of. I came into the profession as a Level 3 apprentice in medical engineering maintenance straight after my GCSEs. I then completed a Level 6 degree apprenticeship in healthcare science, specialising in radiation engineering. After my degree, I became a specialist clinical technologist. Catherine and I work in two areas of clinical technology, but there are many others, including radiation physics, medical physics, clinical engineering and rehabilitation engineering. There are various routes to become a clinical technologist, for example, through apprenticeships, degrees, the IPEM training scheme and on-the-job training. As my career progresses, there are pathways to become an advanced or consultant clinical technologist, where you're running departments, managing equipment on a larger scale and training staff. As a clinical technologist, I feel that I'm making a difference to people's lives every day, giving them the best possible shot at beating whichever disease they are battling and being a friendly face to them during some very difficult moments of their lives. We help to make them comfortable and listen to their concerns and use our technical expertise to help their teams to get key answers. If you want a rewarding career, Clinical Technologist is calling you.